The Economist Intelligence Unit has twice predicted this year that the MPP will win the elections. And this is the Economist Intelligence Unit that predicted in 2012 that you will win the elections. And they also predicted that the Supreme Court verdict will endorse your victory of 2012. Now they have said something else that it looks like Akufado will win the election. They put a caveat, and you should have read the caveat. Mm -hmm. They said it depends on the performance of the economy. Mm -hmm. They said it depends on the performance of the economy. Yes. And they said at the time they were making the assessment, we, had, we were in the middle of the power crisis. The economy was still struggling for stability. Since then, things have changed, factors have changed. The economy is more stable. We just finished the third review uh, mission. It just left last week. And things are on track. The IMF is going to go to the board on the 21st and endorse Ghana's uh, continued program. We've managed to stabilize the power situation. And currently, Ghanaians can see the volume of work that we've done. Probably at the time, the EIU uh, did its prediction. We had not started selling our story. We hadn't come out with a green book. We hadn't started you know, letting Ghanaians see the extent of the work that we had done. And I believe that they are beginning to comprehend what we are doing and where we are going. And so the EIU made that prediction. Yes, but they put a caveat and said that depending on you know, the trend, it was this, they said it was not a foregone conclusion yeah. and that it depended on you know, what happened on the economic front in terms of how people felt. But even if you take the CDD uh, report, mm -hmm. the CDD said over 30% of people feel that their lives are better. Mm -hmm. About another 30% believe that things have not changed. And only about 25% feel that their lives have gotten worse. And so you can see that the trend is not the same across. But the CDD also said 70% of Ghanaians think that the country is being led in the wrong direction. And they also, 48% said that they uh, give me approval for my presidency. Mm. And they believe they have confidence in me. Mm. The, um... So you need to look at it <laughs> variably. But I believe that we're going in the right direction. We've been faced with challenges. And I've always said that I haven't made Ghana a paradise. But from what I took over from my predecessors, I'm taking Ghana to the next level. And when I get a second term, you know, we would see the direction in which we are able to take things.